The U.S. Federal Trade Commission and nearly every U.S. state sued Facebook on Wednesday, saying that it violated antitrust law and should potentially be broken up. That could mean the forced sale of two major platforms it owns, Instagram and WhatsApp. Just a few minutes ago, I led a bipartisan coalition. Of led by New York Attorney General Letitia James, the coalition of 46 states, Washington, D.C., and Guam accused the behemoth social media company of using its dominance in the industry to crush the competition. For nearly a decade, Facebook has used its dominance and monopoly power to crush small arrivals and snuff out competition, all at the expense of everyday users. The complaints on Wednesday accused Facebook of buying up rivals, focusing specifically on its previous acquisitions of Instagram for $1 billion and messaging app WhatsApp for $19 billion. Federal and state regulators said the acquisitions should be unwound. Facebook would try to squeeze every bit of oxygen out of the room for smaller companies that refuse to be bought. They also sent a clear message to the industry. Don't step on Facebook's turf, or as one industry executive put it, you will face the wrath of Mark. Facebook's chief executive Mark Zuckerberg told employees in July that Facebook would go to the mat to fight a legal challenge to break up the company, calling it an existential threat, according to audio of internal company meetings published by The Verge. The U.S. Justice Department sued Alphabet's Google in October, accusing the $1 trillion company of using its market power to fend off rivals. The lawsuits are the biggest antitrust cases in a generation. Facebook shares fell nearly 2% after the news.